Hey everyone, it's Sean here at One Laser, and today we're going to go over a quick maintenance checklist to keep your X-Series laser running smoothly. These are simple things you can do every few months to make sure your machine stays in top shape. Before we get into it, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials. Now let's begin. First up is to check your laser alignment. We're not doing a full alignment procedure, just a quick check. If you'd like a full alignment tutorial, let us know in the comments. Now we'll do a quick tape test, cover mirrors two and three, fire a pulse, and check the beam spots at different locations on the bed. If they line up, you're good. If they're off, that's your cue to run a full alignment. Again, this check should only take a few minutes and be done every couple of months. Next, clean your optics. That means your mirrors and lens. Pop open the laser head cover, wipe mirror three with a rag and some alcohol or lens cleaner. You can either clean the mirror in place or take it out. The same goes for the lens. Just make sure there's no grime building up or cut quality and engraving will suffer. While you're at the head, give the nozzle a wipe down too. A rag with alcohol usually works well. You don't have to remove it unless it's really gunked up. In that case, take it off and clean the inside of the nozzle with a Q-tip. For a severely grimy nozzle, unscrew it and wash with dish soap and hot water. Now let's move to the motion system, your X and Y rails. Use a dry rag to dust them off. If you see buildup, use a little alcohol to loosen it up. No oiling is needed, just keep things clean. Don't forget the exhaust fan. Remove and wipe it down as best you can with alcohol and a rag. A dusty fan results in poor airflow, so stay on top of this one. For XT users, make sure to check your coolant level in the back tank every few months. Open the back panel and top it off if needed. Under the bed, clean out the catch tray. First, pull it out and dump the contents into the trash. Sweep the tray off or wipe it down with alcohol once the bulk of the debris has been removed. It doesn't need to shine, but at least keep it from piling up with bits of flammable material. That's it. Just a few simple checks can make a huge difference in your machine's performance and longevity. If you stay on top of this, your laser will thank you. Thanks for watching.